Hello everyone, welcome to LearnTech. In this video, I'll show to you guys how you can deactivate a Facebook account. The steps are pretty much the same, regardless if you do it on your computer or on your mobile. If you are doing this on your computer, you just open facebook.com on a browser. And if you are doing this on your mobile, you just open on Safari facebook.com. You log in on your account. And once you have logged in on your Facebook account, then you need to go on the logo here, which is your profile. You click over it. And then you need to choose settings and privacy. We click over there. And then we choose once again settings. And over here, we need to click over your Facebook information. From the options on the right, we can see that at the end is the activation. We click over here. And now we have two options. The first one is to deactivate the account. This can be temporary. If you choose the activate account, your account will be disabled and your name and photos will be removed from most things you have shared. You will be able to continue using Messenger. The good thing of this option is that you can reactivate your account at a certain point if you want. The other option is delete account. This is permanent and if you choose this, you will delete the Facebook account. You won't be able to retrieve the content or information you have shared on Facebook. Your messenger and all of your messages will also be deleted. If you just want to take a break from Facebook, you just choose the first option, which is the activate account. And then you click over continue to account activation. Now it will ask you to enter the password. Once you enter the password, you press over continue. Now we can transfer a copy of our post, photos, videos, notes, or events to another service before you deactivate account. If you want to transfer, you click over transfer, and then you can choose from this option here. For example, if you want to transfer your photos, you choose Google Photos and all your photos will be transferred. But if you want to deactivate your account just temporary and you will activate that back, you don't need to transfer the photos because the photos and everything will be still in your account once you activate it. Now over here, you need to specify the reason. For example, I have another Facebook account. I don't feel safe on Facebook or whatever. I'll choose the first option, which is this is temporary. I'll be back. Facebook is popping up this. You can just log out. You don't need to deactivate. But I will press cancel because I really want to deactivate this account. So I press cancel. And for whatever option you choose, you may see a pop-up. For example, I didn't find Facebook useful. It will pop up this window, which will recommend you how you can find Facebook more useful. But you just press over console and that's it. Now, over here, we have the possibility to keep using Messenger. I will unclick this because I don't want Messenger. So I will just click deactivate and my Facebook account and my Messenger will be deactivated. Are you sure you want to deactivate your account? Yes, deactivate now. Now we are seeing this message which is telling your account has been deactivated. To reactivate your account, log in using your old login email and password, and you will be able to use the site like you used before. So basically, in case that you want to reactivate your account, you just open facebook.com and you enter your email and password and you press login and your account is activated again. So those are the steps that you need to do in case that you want to deactivate your Facebook account. I hope you find this video useful and please do not forget to subscribe. Wish to you all the best. Thank you.